Hi, I'm John and welcome to the Racing Line and we are going to feature right now your Castrol Edge Regional Autocross Championships Visayas Finals and we're going to feature some few drivers here of course Eric Book, Alex Xiao, Axel Liao and of course David Lim and David Lim Jr. and Mato Tan do, do check this out Welcome back to the Racing Line. I am John and this is the continuation of our Castrol Edge Regional Autocross Championships. The final round for Visayas. This is the Novice Modified A Class. Franklin Bicoy up against Dodo Paradillo. Eric Ball holds the fastest in this category at 49.33. There we go. 49.33 is the time to beat. Paradillo and Bicoy on the racetrack right now, checking out their previous run, 53.74 and 49.95. Look at that one, with Dodo Paradillo hitting a penalty there in hit one. Let's see if these guys can further improve on their times or even beat Volk in the fastest run for this category. There we go, I think. Paradillo or Bicoy will finish her first but that was a close call let's see Bicoy there you go 51.70 without penalty while Dodo Paradillo 52.03 without penalty still the fastest for this category is Eric Ball at 49.33 Moving on with the Intermediate Modified A, Alex Xiao and Oscar Suarez on the racetrack. Alex Xiao this time holds the fastest at 48.49. Let's see, yes, 48.49. While Oscar Suarez, 49.77. More than one second differential there between the two. Yep, Alex Xiao, 49, 48, 49. Sporting a Honda EG hatch, a familiar car on the racetrack right now. This is your intermediate modified A. Of course, this is the final round of your Castrol Edge Regional Autocross Championships here in Visayas. And there we go, Alex Xiao crossing the start finish line first. 49.60. Without penalty for Yao, Oscar Suarez, 49.72. No penalty also for Oscar Suarez. <laughs> Moving up in the race, Axel Yao driving the same car as his father. And so if you thought that's Alex Yao on the time to be charged, that's already Axel Yao scoring a 4821 is the fastest right now for the intermediate modified A. Axel Yao was able to beat his dad 49 or 4849. Scored a 4821, although he had one penalty in that at 4621. That's a quicker run. Let's see if the younger brother will be able to beat his older brother. Let's see. Yeah. Axel Yao without penalty 48 24. A close one there for Axel Yao. So Axel Yao wins the intermediate modified A class. Yeah. Moving on with the expert modified A on the racetrack right now is David Lim Jr. Of course, David Lim Jr. Oh, something went out there on that car. It's the rear. <laughs> David Lim Jr. pushing that car too hard. So David Lim Jr. holds the passes right here for the expert modified A. So Alex Xiao holds the fastest at 47.27. 
This is the first hit of David Dim Jr. Let's see. A while ago, you saw that that fiberglass back cover of the car went out. Whoa, look at that one. 46-1-0 or 46-11 for David Dim Jr. Yes, there you go. Beating Alex Yao, 47-7. So David Dean Jr. now holds the fastest at 46-11 without penalty in the expert modified A class. <laughs> Moving on, David Lim right now on the racetrack for the expert modified A. Looking at David Lim's time in hit one. So David Lim Jr. further improved here at 45.55. Look at that one, David Lim Jr. further pushing the, his car to the limits. And checking out David Lim's time at 45.87. That's a quick run for David Lim. Let's see if he can further improve here. David Lim looking good so far. But the guy that we are going to check out is Jess Garcia. Later on, we'll see Jess Garcia running here. <laughs> David Lim, 46-3-0 without penalty. So David Lim Jr. wins the intermediate modified A. David Lim failed to beat his son in this category. This shows that David Lim is or David Dim Jr. is indeed pushing right now. So Novice Modified B, Ak So Yao and Eric Ball. Novice Modified B. So that's Ak So Yao holding the fastest right now at 48.83. Eric Ball's time 51.58 with one penalty. That's 53.58. A while ago, I mentioned about Jess Garcia. He's the man to beat here. He is leading the 2012 Visayas Driver of the Year Championship points with two points. We are yet to see him. Of course, the man following him is David Lim Jr., who we've seen running in this episode. So, let's see. There we go. Eric Ball crossing the start, or yes, Eric Ball, Axel Yao crosses the start finish line first there. There we go, look at the disparity there of the time, 47.93 without penalty for Axel Yao, 52.64 with one penalty for Eric Ball. So Axel Yao still holds the fastest right here, Willeran Peña and Franklin Bicoy. Let's see if any of this driver can beat Axel Yao's time at 47.93. Checking out Willard and Pena's time, 49.68 with two penalties. While Vicoy, clean run, although 52.69. It's going to be crucial here for both drivers. Axel Yao is in the 40s or 47 barrier while both drivers are in the 50s. So I think it's a walk in the park right here for Axo Yao, but definitely both drivers will be eyeing for the second and third. Let's see. Oh, look at that one, Will Rampenya. <laughs> Let's see, Will Rampenya. Oh, there we go, Will Rampenya, 49-34 with one penalty, while Franklin Bicoy, 52-97 without penalty. Supposed to be in bed, but telling stories about your life when I was not high boss. Yeah, I'm sure this hot back in the days with the boot. Like I knew when you was out there getting paid with the pay with the you get the when you're hitting the days, it's not your beat. Go, go, yeah, you know I'm from. 
don't even know you, but you do not know me. Quit out ball and get down for you to not on me. You don't wanna know what I've been thinking of. You better go ahead on and find you another spot to chill, cause I've been dipping them dust. We see a light and everything ain't great. It's like everybody mine is in the same old state, you know? Although I knew I quit his revenues, I'ma tell you four nigga things I'ma never do. I'm never gonna stop trying to get it, dude. Never turn my back on my city. Never let the money through the brick, man. Stop hollering and the sense go and the sense go and the sense go So there you have it a good race between all the racers there in Cebu City and of course please do check out the rest of our races here on the Racing Line and please also do like us in Facebook that's the Racing Line TV do like our page and you get to get more news and happening in the regional series of our Castrol Edge Regional Autocross and of course Castrol Power One Regional Underbone Grand Prix and please do check out the rest of the videos here in our channel